क्वेश्चन इज गिवन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी वन माइनस नाइन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी वन डिवाइडेड बाई नाइन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी सो वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट दी वैल्यू ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन हाउ वी कैन फाइंड आउट दी वैल्यू ऑफ दिस टर्म लेट्स ई सोल्यूशन स्क्वायर रूट स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी डिवाइडेड बाय नाइन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ सॉरी स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी वन डिवाइडेड बाय नाइन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी राइट दिस इज क्वेश्चन सो वी कैन सॉल्व दिस एटी वन स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी वन डिवाइडेड बाय नाइन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी सो फर्स्ट वी हैव टू रेशनलाइज दिस डिनोमिनेटर टू रेशनलाइज दिस डिनोमिनेटर वी हैव टू मल्टीप्लाई नाइन प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी ऑन न्यूमिनेटर एंड डिनोमिनेटर नाउ वी आर मल्टीप्लाइंग विथ नाइन प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी इन न्यूमिनेटर एंड इन डिनोमिनेटर स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी राइट नाउ इज इक्वल टू नाउ यर नाइन माइनस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी नाइन प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एटी सो ए माइनस बी टाइम्स ए प्लस बी is equal to a square minus b square. This is formula. So here a minus b plus b is given. So we can write this. Eighty one times nine plus square root of eighty divided by a square minus b square square root of eighty a square minus b square. Now is equal to Eighty one times nine plus square root of eighty divided by nine square that is eighty one minus uh, here eighty square. Sorry, uh, ha, square is cancelled from square root, so it will become eighty here, right? Now eighty one times nine plus square root of eighty divided by eighty one minus eighty that is one. So we can write this eighty one nine plus square root of eighty. Now we know one formula that if square root of a times b is given, so we can write this square root of a times square root of b, right? So using this formula, we can write this one square root of eighty one times square root of nine plus square root of 80, right? Now, square root of 81. So square root of 81 is 9. So 9 times square root of 9 plus square root of 80. Now, we can here multiply and divide in numerator and denominator by 2. So we have to here multiply and divide in numerator and denominator by 2 then we will get here is equal to 9 times square root of 9 plus square root of 80 multiply by 2 and divide by 2 right now so equal to 9 times square root of Now we have to multiply this term. So two nine is eighteen plus two square root of eighty divided by two. Right now is equal to nine times square root. This eighteen we can write ten plus eight. Ten plus eight that is eighteen, and ten is a eighty. Right. So we can write this ten plus eight. Plus two times square root of eighty. Two times square root of eighty divided by two. Now is equal to nine times square root. Now this is ten. So this ten we can convert in square root of ten whole square. So when square is cancelled from square root, it will become ten plus square root of eight. Whole square square is cancelled from square root, so here eight plus two times square root of this eighty we can write ten times square root of eight, right? Ten is a eighty. 
divided by square root of 2 and here square square is cancelled from square root so value is same that is 2 now why we are doing this one this step because we are converting here a square plus b square plus 2 ab form if you know one formula that is a square plus b square plus 2 ab is equal to a plus b whole square now here you can consider a equal to square root of 10 and b equal to square root of 8 so a plus b a square plus b square plus 2 times a b now so we can write this a plus b whole square where a is square root of 10 plus b b is square root of 8 a plus b whole square and here square root divided by square root of 2 this one right now again we are using one formula that is if square root of a upon b is given so we can write uh, square root of a upon b whole square is given so we can write this square root of a upon b square this one is given so we can write a upon b whole square right so using this formula here we can write this one square root square root of 10 plus square root of 8 divided by square root of 2 to the whole square because this one is whole square so a square is cancelled from so here this is 9 9 times now is equal to 9 times we got here value that is uh, square root of 10 plus square root of 8 divided by square root of 2 we got this value now we can write this one is equal to 9 upon square root of 2 times square root of 10 plus square root of 8 in this form now we have to rationalize this denominator is equal to 9 square root of 2 we are rationalize this denominator so we have to multiply by square root of 2 and divide by square root of 2 times square root of 10 plus square root of 8 now is equal to 9 square root of 2 so 9 square root of 2 divided by square root of 2 square root of 2 square root of 2 whole square so square is cancelled from square root here it will become 2 times square root of 10 plus square root of 8 right now is equal to 9 square root of 2 divided by 2 times square root of 10 plus square root of 8 this is square root of 8 we can write square root of 4 times square root of 2 4 to the 8 so 4 times square root of 2 now is equal to 9 square root of 2 divided by 2 times square root of 10 plus square root of 4 is 2 2 square root of 2 right now now we have to multiply this term with this term so is equal to 9 square root of 2 divided by 2 times square root of 10 plus 9 square root of 2 divided by 2 times 2 square root of 2 right now these two is cancelled from these two so we can write here is equal to 9 now uh, 10 to the 20 so square root of 20 divided by 2 plus 9 square root of 2 times square root of 2 so is equal to 9 square root of 20 divided by 2 plus 9 square root of 4 now 9 square root of 20 so this 9 square root of 20 divided by 2 plus 9 square root of 4 we can write to 9 times 2 is equal to 9 square root of 20 divided by 2 plus 9 to the 18 right now is equal to 9 square root of 20 square root of 20 again we can convert this 4 times 5 so 9 square root of 4 times 5 4 5 are 20 divided by 2 plus 18 is equal to 9 square root of 4 that is 2 so 9 to the 18 here will become 2 times square root of 5 divided by 2 
plus 18. Now, 9 times 2 times the square root of 5 plus uh, square, uh, square root of 5 divided by 2 plus 18. Right? So, this 2 is cancelled from this 2 here. So, 9 square root of 5 plus 18. Right? Now, 9 square root of 5 plus 18. So, we can take here common 9. So, square root of 5 plus 9 to the 18. So, it will become is equal to. Now, is equal to or we can write 9 times 2 plus square root of 5. And this is the solution. So, we can say square root of 81 divided by 9 minus square root of 80 is equal to 9 times 2 plus square root of 5. This is the solution. Thank you.